The baseball season's about to start, and it's going to start uh, this week, uh, this week coming up. Right. For the Padres, they are going to be in New York taking on the New York Mets, and uh, we are about to try something pretty interesting right now. Uh, joining us via FaceTime, iPads right here. Uh, this is so cool, man. This is so cool. I got to just show, show you this. Show just just check this toys. out. This is really <laughs> cool. Uh, joining us right now on FaceTime is Micah Kovner. He's a Padre fan who went apparently above and beyond before being named the Padres number one fan. And uh, he won the, uh, the, this title after uh, replying to a posting on Instagram where he made a collage of all of his Padres memorabilia. Micah, can you hear us? Yeah, absolutely. All right, Hi. man. This is cool. Uh, yeah. So, okay, just take us through this. How, how did you find out about a contest to become the Padres' number one fan? Uh, it was pretty simple, actually. Um, I was kind of bored on my lunch break at work, and I went on Instagram, and uh, I followed the Padres on Instagram. And they just put up a post saying, if you think you're the ultimate Padres fan and you want to earn a trip to New York for opening day, send in a pic of why you're the ultimate fan and had my sister kind of help me pull some of our stuff together and put up the picture and I won, luckily. Uh, can I just ask, are you holding an iPad right now? No, I'm holding my phone right now, actually. Oh. Dude, you're no, making me a little know, motion sick right now. I swear to <laughs> you, I'm getting a little motion sickness right now with you and the moving around. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You're fine. I'm, He's I'm excited. Only teasing you. Yeah, no, no. Uh, so, Micah, so you, did you grow up in San Diego? Have you always been a fan? Yeah, uh, I, I grew up in San Diego. Um, I graduated and went to school in college in Orange County, but I've been a Padre fan my entire life. I mean, even when, like, my mom was pregnant with me, she was going to Padre games. So, since day one, I guess you could say I'm a Padre fan. Uh, yeah, my entire life, I guess my, my dream job would have been to play for the Padres. And then when I realized I was not good at baseball anymore, I wish <laughs> I could become a GM of the Padres. So kind of been attached since you know, kid. Let's take a look at the picture that, that uh, you won with. Here, here it is. This is the collage you made. Oh, very nice. That, uh, that won the contest for you. You yeah. got a shot at Petco Park. You got some autographed baseballs in there. You got some, some ticket stubs, it looks like. You got the old school hat on very cool so you win nice. this contest through the Padres as the Padres number one fan nice shot by the way guys I like that Thanks. Um, <laughs> what, what do you uh, what, do, what did you win exactly this trip to New York is that where are you right now uh, I'm I'm in my room right now I'm I've, I live in actually Orange County right now um, because I'm working up here but what's gonna happen is on Monday they're gonna send me I actually just found out about 30 minutes ago that I'm gonna take a friend with me um, but they're going to send me to New York. Uh, I'm going to go to the MLB Fan Cave that's in New York, uh, which is kind of this like multimedia uh, fan experience where they have people from all different regions, like super fans, stay there in New York all season and watch all the games. I'm going to meet the players. I'm going to meet the Padres at the Fan Cave on Tuesday on their day off. And then on Wednesday, I'm going to go to the Padres-Mets game and handful of other activities in between all that so it's, it's gonna be a pretty cool experience nice. Dude, that I, is awesome i've had all of your friends yeah. at this moment now that they know you can bring one friend are you getting a lot of calls i've already anyway? started thinking about uh the bidding process of what it's going to take to <laughs> get on this uh, my mind's going crazy with what what contest is going to be for my personal friends to get on this. <laughs> hey nice. we got about 30 seconds to go what do you do up there in orange county what do you do because you said that you did this while you were at work what do you do I, I do outside sales. Uh, I, I work for like a, a logistics, like freight broker company up here. Um, so I was just kind of bored one day, and, and luckily and I, I found. And, it. and I like your uh, your. And, and by the way, we're, as we're seeing the FaceTime, look at this. You got the one box I here know. of us. You got the box up here of Micah, and you've got the box of us uh, right here doing a little FaceTiming. I, I like your Trevor Hoffman framed jersey behind you. Yeah, yeah, that's that's for my sister. She gave me every single year. She's gave me I'll kind of get a shot here. She gave me a, a framed a Union Tribune of you know different events of, of stuff that's happened in Padre history. That's when uh, Tony got in the Hall of Fame. Kind of like my prized possessions, I'd say, like uh, of some of the most you know historical things that happened in Padres history. Hey, listen, um, to be continued, let, let's hook up with you in New York. Let's let's do this FaceTime thing all over yeah. again. Yeah, I want to know how I, it's going. I think uh, Padre fans will be excited to hear what the number one Padre fan gets to do <laughs> while in New York. And 
we'll talk about it uh, after the season starts. We'll see how, how the Padres make out in their first couple of games. And uh, maybe you'll be able to give us a preview after talking to the players. And if you need a friend to go, yeah, definitely. I'm right here. Oh, so really? Just call me. Oh, yeah? <laughs> I'll let you know how the bidding process goes. All, All right. right, right on. Micah, take care and congratulations. <laughs>